The question is, let y be equal to cos 2x minus 2 sin x. Find dy on dx, and hence find all solutions of the equation dy on dx equals 0, with 0 is less than or equal to x, which is less than or equal to 2 pi. So let's write it up. y is equal to cos of 2x minus 2 sin x. OK. Well, I've got two bits. I can just differentiate them separately. dy on dx is equal to... Well, this one I need the chain rule for because I've got cos with something inside it that's not just x. So the derivative of the outside would be the derivative of cos, which is minus sine. And then I have to multiply by the derivative of the inside, which is 2. And over here on the next one, I've got sine x, I've got minus 2 sine x, so that's just a constant multiplied by sine. So when a constant's multiplied on, it just stays there when you differentiate, and you just differentiate the other bit. So the deriv derivative of sine is cos. OK, so that's equal to minus 2 sine 2x minus 2 cos x. So we want to solve dy on dx equals 0. So let dy on dx be equal to 0. So that means that 2 sine of 2x minus 2 cos x is equal to 0. Well, I could divide everything by minus 2. That would make it a little bit simpler. Sine 2x plus cos x equals 0. All right. Well, I suppose I could get sine 2x equals minus cos x, but I've got no idea how to solve that. Um, Maybe I should expand out the sine 2x. 2 sine x cos x plus cos x equals 0. Well, that means now I can take out a cos x. So cos x times 2 sine x plus 1 equals 0. Now I've got two things multiplied together equal to 0, so that means that either cos x is 0 or 2 sine x plus 1 is 0. So cos x equals 0. That would mean that, uh, let's think about that, cos is the x-coordinate, so the places where the x-coordinate is 0 on the unit circle is here and here because they line up with x equals 0 on the x-axis. So x is equal to um, plus or minus pi on 2. And well, we were making sure our x's were between 0 and 2 pi, so it's actually pi on 2 and 3 pi on 2. OK. I should probably say, or, or 2 sine x plus 1 equals 0, which would be 2 sine x equals 1, S well, minus 1, sine x equals minus a half. OK, so let's think about that. 1, 2, root 3, pi on 6, just there. So x is going to be some variant of pi on 6, but we want sine of it to be minus a half. Two. So sine is negative down here. So we're going to have minus pi on 6 and pi plus pi on 6. So x is equal to minus pi on 6 and pi plus pi on oh it's not those is it because it's in it's in um, the range from 0 to 2 pi 
So it's pi plus pi on 6 and 2 pi minus pi on 6. Pi plus pi on 6, which is this one here, and 2 pi minus pi on 6, which is this one here. So that would be 7 pi on 6 and 12 pi on 6 minus pi on 6, so 11 pi on 6. So therefore, dy on dx equals 0 when x is equal to pi on 2, 3 pi on 2, 7 pi on 6, or 11 pi on 6. Six.